Doma, a good three points. Yeah, great three points for us, obviously, and a push for the playoffs, as we said. So we set out all week to come here and get three points. We know how close it is now, and obviously with other games being off and results going away, I think now if we win on Tuesday night, we can go right into the playoff spots. It's always a tough game at Dumbarton, but the conditions today made it even tougher. Uh, it was obviously it was um, not ideal with the snow and the rainfall, the pitch wasn't the best, but fair play to the staff here, they got it on and both teams had to play in the same pitch so we can have no complaints. I thought first half it kind of caught us out a wee bit, we weren't used to it, but second half I thought we were very comfortable, played when we could play and done the ugly side of the game that we need to do and overall it's a good three points. Given the conditions... It was actually not a bad game of football. It was probably a good um, spectate for the neutral, but uh, for us the most important thing is getting the three points and um, take us closer to that playoff position again. That's what you want to do, and as you see, coming to places like Dumbarton, this is where you need to pick up those points. You do, I might well, obviously been the prettiest of game, but at the end of the day it's the three points. And when you look back at the end of the season, you're going to look at games last where you've had to graft out a, a three points, and just a 1-0 win will take that. The gaffer spot about previous games, I think the team went to Livingston and get three points in a 1-0 scrap of game, but at the end of the day, these three points add up and it can, that can take you into the playoffs. You said there as well, you know, you had to do the ugly side of the game near the end and yeah. there was some good defending. Yeah, I thought the defence were brilliant from start to finish, but especially the last five, ten minutes where Dumbarton really went for it. Um, I thought the boys done brilliant at the back. They've been brilliant since I came here. I think that might actually be the third clean sheet in a row for us, so that's positive for us getting into the, the crucial games coming up. When you come to places like Dumbarton as well, it, it, both teams wanted to win today, didn't they? Yeah, obviously we've got different reasons for wanting to win. They want to get their out and kind of get comfortable. And for us, we're looking to go into that playoffs. But both teams wanted it, and I th but I think we wanted it more, obviously. And, and that's how we've got the result in the end. The gaffer said that to us. Whatever team wants it more, especially with the conditions, will win the game. And fortunately it was us. Coming from a goal from yourself? Aye, the goal's no bad, but um, the most important thing, obviously, is the three points. So I'll take that up the road, happy. When you stepped up to take it, were you just picking your spot? Well, me and Dobbs, and we're going to, Dobbs was maybe going to go near post, depending on how the wall set up, but the wall kind of cut that off, so it was down to me to hit it, and fortunately enough, it's went in the bottom corner. You scored a few like that in your time? Oh, I've no real, I think that might be the first free kick I've actually scored, but uh, I think after that I'll be on the free kicks now. Fighting Dobby for them? Aye, well, Dobbs is a master, isn't he? So if he wants to take your free kicks and feels confident, then I'll leave it to Dobbs. Tuesday night, the games are starting to come thick and fast. Another big one on Tuesday against United? Definitely, I think it's 10 games now, the gaffer said. So for us, it's every game's massive. We need three points everywhere we can get. And Tuesday night, none really bigger than that. Dundee United, a good team. Kind of, we're fighting with them to get into the playoffs. But the boys will be confident after that win. We'll take the momentum up to Palmerston and hopefully three points again. It's the first of a, a sort of, well, today was the first of a big five game stretch in two weeks ago. Yeah, that's it. I think we're playing Saturday, Tuesday now, but the boys will be ready. We're sharp in training, we're fit. The gaffer's got us really ready for it. And we know that's just, we need to commit ourselves to play Saturday, Tuesday. We're obviously not used to it, but it's something we'll take in our stride. You're going into this game against United. You've talked about moving closer to the playoffs. United are a team that you'll have in your sights? Definitely. I think the way it works out, that if we win on Tuesday, we can actually go in front of them. So that's a, you don't need much more than that. Do you know what I mean? I think that'll be the gaffer's team talk. You win the night, boys, and you just go ahead of them. And you want to start winning at Palmerston as Definitely. well? Definitely. We need to get three points everywhere we can, if it's where it's home away. But aye, we need to get three points at Palmerston. would be crucial going through into the playoffs. Been quite a few draws this season, so you want to start turning that into wins? Yeah, a lot. There's been two draws since I've came, obviously, but um, I've got to take it was two clean sheets as well, do you know what I mean? So we, we, we know fine well we'll, we'll create chances. We like Adele coming back in and Dobbs. Um, hopefully, we'll chip in with the goals and we feel confident in front of goals. So for us, if the defence keep doing their job, we'll, we'll do our job. Back in for a few weeks now, so still in. Loving it? Yeah, it's, uh, it's good here, I love it. I'm obviously working with the gaff and dig every day. The boys are brilliant and um, the training's really good. I'm feeling confident again. So for me, it's ideal and hopefully if we get in the playoffs, that would just round it off for me.